Hey America. Yeah, I found the stand. Man, the stand and the coffee and the water were close and I just sharpened my blade. Way I do it. Here, you wanna see real quick? No, I'm not showing you my kitchen, it's a mess. <laughs> but wait, well, I, I do it with um James gave me this blade. Um so hear that sound? That's the sound you want to make. That nice, that nice tone. Sounds better underwater. My ways. Now I got washed. All right, so I, um, I bought another fillet at Winco. This one was just 20 bucks. Now I've already got several steaks out of it. And what we're gonna do here is um, get rid of the rest of the silver skin. Never have two knives on the board. Two knives on the board will get you cut. It's a rule that I um, overlook too much. I've been cut. Uh, I don't like getting cut. I've been cut before. I don't like being cut. Yeah. I never cut anybody. And I can count maybe the person I burned burned on one hand, and that was just like pure accident. I got hot hands, and if I put something up in the window, sometimes it's too hot for other people to pick up. And then occasionally you get like some oil splash or run into somebody. All right, so let me get rid of that. Just doesn't look good. Oh, this here, like, yeah. So this right here, check it out. All right, you like that? Let me get that meat off of there. So if I'm gonna make a mash or like a burrito or something like that, yeah. And, uh, you know, so you don't lose that meat. Just because you had to cut um, the skin off doesn't mean you have to lose all that meat there. You come back and get it again. Same thing with fish. A lot of people don't do that with fish. And when you, when you fillet a fish, man, take a spoon, nice sharp spoon, and just get in there and dig around. And you'll come out with this nice pile of salmon or halibut or whatever your fresh caught fish is that's an i think an important thing to do you know and um you'd be amazed out how much extra food you can come out of it you know students at lane you know but you're hearing this because you guys do a lot of salmon you should scrape all that salmon down and and, and you know make moose out of it you know if you got enough of it you know, I love to make some force meat stuff, man. You guys get the equipment over there. I don't have the equipment. I'd love to have a robo coop, man. All right. And this big daddy. Oh, we got a little bit more. This is just for the cats, man. Yeah, I'm going to have, like, free kittens again. She got out in the last place, and she's waddling around the house now. She got out one time, man. But, you know, I was having a hard time moving to the last place, and she got out one time. <laughs> so I've been beefing up her diet. I want good, healthy kittens again. 
Everybody got these um, ones said they're some of the best kittens in the world. One kitten actually is Freya Jr., the one I call Trixie. And she sleeps with a two, little two-year-old girl. I know who the mama is. All right, I'm on a little steak right now. Um, and we're going to do something with this. Um, I have an, another Asian idea that I'm going to do. But um, for now, I'm just going to... And then I'm going to make some, just some steaks. All right. And then um, just chunk that. Maybe I'll do a burrito or something. And uh, yeah, one bag, you know. I use a bag smart. So yeah, this is a filet mignon, it cost me $20, I've already had um, the beef and broccoli, oh you guys can't see it all, I'm sorry, alright, so I'm putting them in the bag like that, sitting them kind of flat wise, this is the chunky part, and then, then I roll them on top of each other, so they don't stick to each other, and they take up less space like that, and then this is the big one, I'm going to put this right here, Okay, turn that once. All right. I know it's weird, man. I just kind of twist it up and, like, you know, I'd rather use these bags over and over. If I properly flatten it down, I can get a decent seal. And now I got a nice little cut there. I just want a little snack. Now, when you do a tuck like that, it's important to put it into the fridge flat, which I just did not do. All right, so I just want to show you that breakdown. I'm just going to throw something together quick.